The slope-intercept form of the equation of a line with slope m and y-intercept 0b is y equals mx plus b. Again, m represents the slope of the line, and b is the y-coordinate of the y-intercept of the line. Here we are asked to graph the line given by y equals 2 thirds x minus 4. We learned how to graph this using a table already, but now let's graph it just by understanding the form of the equation. So I see that this is in slope-intercept form, and that the slope is 2 thirds, and that the y-intercept is the ordered pair 0, negative 4. So to graph this line, what we can do is plot the y-intercept, all right, so 0, negative 4, assuming a standard scale, we have 0, negative 4. And then second, use the slope to plot a second point on the line. Since the slope is 2 thirds, I can think of that as a rise of 2 and a run of 3. So from the point that I've already plotted, rise 2 units, run 3 units, plot a second point on the line. And now draw the line through the two points. Let's see another example. Graph the line given by y equals negative 5 halves x plus 1. Again, I recognize this as being in slope-intercept form with slope negative 5 halves and y-intercept at 0, 1. Plotting the y-intercept at 0, 1, now using the slope. Now, since it's negative 5 halves, I'm going to think of it as a negative 5 over 2, which means I'm going to rise negative 5. That's the same as thinking fall 5 and run 2. So the initial slope was negative. When we have a negative slope, the line falls from left to right. So I will let it fall 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 units, and then run 1, 2 units, and plot my second point on the line at 2, negative 4. Drawing the line through the points. There's the line y equals negative 5 halves x plus 1. 